afternoon, it's January the 8th, 2018. Hard to believe we're saying 2018. Anyways, on Friday night, which was, looking at the calendar, the 5th, I had a shit hit the fan situation. I got home early from work because it was very stormy and the wind was blowing. We had had snow every day since Christmas here. We just had a hurricane come through with winds. Thankfully, I didn't lose my power. I went to work, came to get home, and my S8 should hit the fan situation was my house key wasn't working. I couldn't get it in. The hole all the way, and I knew what it was. My lock was froze. Dampness got in, and I don't have a backup key, that's all I'm going to get, and I don't have a key for the door. So all I had was one key, and I really wanted to get in the house. I had five minutes left. I went to the store after I checked my truck and I got some of this. That's the French side. Everything is bilingual here in Canada, but that's Ice D Locker. And at the grocery store around the corner, $1.79, went there and got that today. I went and got that that night. Actually, I got two because I checked my bag that I keep in the truck, bug out bag, get home bag, whatever, and I had none in it. Now, I've seen this at the dollar store. I've had it in the past. It's just one of those things that's small, slipped out of my mind. And now, when I needed it, I didn't have it. So I went, I got it, put it in, worked right away, got in the house. Happy days for me here in Yarmouth. But it, it's great to have, and also you'll notice on there, it's got a little flame. If you need to, it can help you start a fire. And I've done that with it. And it's a nice little bottle. So now, I will be carrying this with me in my coat. And I ordered myself a little pouch to carry around on my belt, and I'll have that in it for the winter. Now, Christmas, so today I was at Canadian Tire, and I picked up another package here. And I just had the receipt, and I don't know what I did with it, because I couldn't find my keys. I think that was $2.99, and that was $1.79. So one is none, two or, you know, one is none, two or one, three or two. How it goes. So now I have this in my pocket every day. My coat pocket, I'll have this as a spare in the house. And then I will have as well one in my pack in the truck. Because where I work, call center, someone's going to need some eventually. So Christmas has come and gone. What did I get? My kids know I'm into prepping and survival, so they got me one of these here dollar store power packs. You charge in and go. I have a whack of these, but since I've moved here from living on the cottage to here, I can't find them. So I was glad to have that, and yeah. So I was glad to have that. I thought that some of my family would have been over the power went out, but it didn't. But these are great to have. You get them at the dollar store if you need them. They're great. Um, my daughter knows I like camping, bushcraft, and all that kind of stuff. Move that out of the way. And so she picked me up this here. Oops. It's a survival candle. And it's made with beeswax. And again, it's pretty nifty-difty here. I would have used it if I had to need it. With beeswax, it will make it grow, or not grow longer, but last longer. Grow a nice flame, maybe. And put that on there. And wham bam, there we go. So I put your pot on there and you could cook. Although with, I wonder with beeswax, it would probably be sooty. They even give you a couple of matches. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see, handmade in Canada. That's kind of neat. Uh, a real life saber when you need it, indoor and outdoor. So it's pretty cool. Bob, uh, of course, it's uh, French there. I'm not, I can't speak French or read it. So that's, that was a pretty neat Christmas gift. I like that. Uh, also, she went to the Army Navy surplus store in Halifax, which I asked her to do. And she picked up this, which I have not seen. It's the Smith's uh, t Natural Tender Maker. So you got your tender maker, which is like a grater. But it has a little container. You keep it in. I haven't opened it yet. I'm going to wait. And a fire striker. And this here, I don't know, to cut with. Oh, there it is. It's a striker. That's your striker. A silly thing. Your fire starter and your tinderbox. Removable lid with stainless steel blade. So that's that's actually a pretty good deal. So you could pre-have that. You could pre-load that with some fat wood you can get. Of course, here we have to buy it like this. So you could do it like that. 
have it loaded, and I think that would be pretty good. And Smiths, they make pretty good products. Uh, easy, moderate, advanced. It's the easy level. So that's that's kind of interesting there. What level of survival are you at? Easy, moderate, or advanced? Okay. Well, and I also, someone gave me one of these here knife sharpeners. I had one before, but it's kind of cool. They're thinking right. That's the idea. They were thinking right. And my dog got me this nice knife. I'm glad they, the dog did that. I haven't opened up yet. And uh, yeah, nice one to do that, 2.5. Uh, Avalanche, it was from Winners. They went there, comes with a little pack. It's kind of neat. And the cat got me this. Here, and I have not opened this up yet. And they only had two. So I picked up one, it's a real treat. And you got your nice spoon for it. Uh, bottle opener or a beer can beer bottle opener which is good and since I moved I can't find my tripod cart for my big tripod so I'm using this dinky little thing okay I want to make this video I didn't want to make it very long but this is kind of cool four quick deploying tools uh, high quality materials low profile design on the back there you go you get the picture of it get the idea of it and uh, although I must say Oops, always got to have a, a camera fall. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Oh, the leg went down. There we go. Yeah. Oh. So, I don't know. That looks like a pretty big spoon. My mouth's not that big. But the cat got up on me for Christmas, so what, what could I say? I hope you're enjoying your winter. I, I'm i sorry none of my videos now are like they were when I was done at a camp. But if you want to get out and it's uh, just winter time and work and winter and work and work and work and sleep and work, you know how it is. But regaining my preps, got some ideas I'm going to be working on. And I uh, hope you had a great day. Hope you had a great Christmas, even though it's a little late. Like, subscribe, and comment. To all my new subscribers, thank you for subscribing. And uh, share my channel around. And let's build it up. Have a great day. Thank you.